You know, as you look at the coconut tree waving a little bit in the wind and see the coconuts hanging off there, <coughs> think to ourselves, are we nuts? Like those coconuts. Are we crazy? Our lifestyle is a little bit crazy. We're in the middle of Indonesia, a country halfway around the world from our friends and family with chickens and goats and dogs and children and everything all over the place. And some people would look at our life and think, yeah, we're a little nuts. But you know what? We love our life. We are so blessed to be doing what we love and helping people. This is our Back in January, we got to spend three weeks training 20 plus students how to teach. You know, we sent out eight teams to eight different countries. They are training and challenging people to study their Bible. Back to us. We're here in Indonesia and we've been able to teach these 24 students. We spent a month with them in the New Testament. They got to do timelines, they got to read books, they got to see teaching, they got to be challenged about the way they live life. We did a month in the Old Testament. So we took them through Kings, they did a timeline. They got to uh, see how the prophets worked and what they did and what their role was and it was really good. And this last week we've been teaching them how to teach. We believe in, in multiplying ourselves and, and giving stuff so that people grow and, and then can use it Actually, this coming Friday is their graduation and so we're really thrilled to be able to send them off and commission them into their ministries that they're a part of here. You know one of our students actually he had to sell his dog to make some money so that he could get a ride to here. He didn't even have any money not even to get here. Yeah, I'm really glad to follow this SBS. Uh, I'm really glad to follow this SBS. Ya, sudah lama saya rindu untuk bisa belajar. This is my long desire to do SBS. Ya, ada banyak hal yang saya dapatkan. I get a lot of things. Ya, pemahaman firman Tuhan itu. Especially I can understand more ya. about the word of God. Ya, karena saya juga biasa suka berkhotbah. Because I like to preaching. Supaya saya mengerti isi dari kebenaran firman Tuhan itu. So I gain more about uh, what the things the Bible says. Yang terlebih penting lagi dalam penerapannya. And more important about how I doing application application in my life. Ya, karena kalau kita salah mengerti. Because if we not gain a good understanding from the Bible. Ya, kita bisa salah terapkan. We can doing uh, something wrong in our life. Ya, saya senang itu yang terpenting buat saya. saya so the more important in my life my life is about application. Ya, Tuhan memberkati. God bless. I love you. Hey, we say yes, Many of you there at home in Kilcona are parents and we are learning what that means. How to be parents, how to have a child, how to raise a child. It's actually really exciting. Cassie is growing, she has two little teeth now and she's learning how to play games like Where's Cassie? There she is! Over and over and over. I'm a new dad, it's stressful, uh, there are many days where I wonder what I'm doing and there's often times I'm scared or I say to myself or I say to Anne, I can't believe we have a girl, I can't believe we have a little daughter, I can't believe we have a child, I'm not ready for this. You know she's probably one of the most uh, awesomest things I've ever experienced in my life. I love her so much. It kind of makes me sad. I see our team get to spend so much time with Cassie. And I think to myself, if we were at home, every one of you would have that opportunity too to spend time with her. We don't want to dwell on that sadness. But at the same time, uh, you should know that we are so excited and, and hopeful and we wait expectantly for the time when we can come home and spend three or four months at home we're not exactly sure when that's going to be. It might be at the end of this coming year or maybe at the beginning of next year. We're just still praying about that, but we're looking forward to spending some time at home with you guys the next time we come home. Thank you so much for making it happen, not just from our hearts, but for sure so much from these hearts. And uh, every one of them 
would give you a big hug and say thank you. Thank you for sending Ben and Ange. Thank you for allowing them to train up these teachers because they couldn't have done it on their own, so they say, Terimakasi, Banyak. Thank you very much. Thank <laughs> you.